December is almost here. Santa Claus will be taking to the skies, and he won't be alone. Along with the reindeer doing all the work pulling his sleigh, the skies are going to be crowded with spaceships and balloons thanks to Amazon Prime Video. For most movie fans, Felicity Jones is likely best remembered as the reluctant hero Jyn Erso in 2016's Rogue One A Star Wars Story. On December 6th, she'll be taking a trip back to the 19th century to become a pilot in the Amazon original film The Aeronauts. Jones plays Daredevil pilot Amelia Wren, accompanied by James Glacier, played by Eddie Redmayne. Wren takes to the sky via balloon in hopes of making new discoveries in the clouds. The pair run into trouble on one of their airborne adventures, and rather than discovering new science, they find themselves in a fight to survive. The Aeronauts is fiction, but boasts some solid footing in actual history. While Wren is a purely fictional character, James Glacier was a real meteorologist working in the 19th century. Based on the best-selling series of novels by Daniel Abram and Ty Frank, The Expanse premiered on Sci-Fi to critical and commercial success in 2015. The series follows a crew of anti-heroes who uncover a vast conspiracy during a time when humanity has colonized the stars. Unfortunately, Sci-Fi announced The Expanse's third season would be its last in May 2018. Thankfully for fans, Amazon Prime Video stepped up to give the acclaimed series a new home. The show's third season ended with the crew of the Rocinante traveling through the Ring Gate to an entirely new region of space. All the surviving characters of the previous season will be returning, but The Expanse will have some new faces as well. Lindy Greenwood joins the cast as Dr. Elvin Okoye, a UN scientist sent to explore a new planet. Vern Gorman will appear as Adolphus Murtry, a man who wants to be the top dog in the new planet and doesn't care what he has to do to make that happen. Someday I think you and I are going to end up bloody. Amazon Prime Video is bringing plenty of action flicks to the streaming service in December, including a couple that are more than meets the eye. When it comes to its superhero fare, Prime Video is going outside the box. As of December 1st, subscribers can watch 2008's Hancock, in which Will Smith plays a deadbeat guy with Superman-like powers who has to figure out how to be a genuine hero. On December 11th, subscribers can watch 2018's Fast Color. Starring Gugu Mbatha-Raw as a young homeless woman with emerging powers she hasn't learned to control. Don't expect this to be the last you see of Fast Color on Amazon either. In July 2019, it was announced Amazon Studios is developing an original series based on the film. If you're eager for robot action, you'll be able to stream 2018's Bumblebee, starring Haley Steinfeld, George Lendenberg Jr., and wrestler John Cena on December 13th. Finally, on December 30th, Amazon will stream 2011's action-packed Transformers Dark of the Moon. If you prefer your entertainment on the more thrilling and terrifying side of things, Amazon Prime Video has some new offerings in December that might pique your interest. On December 1st, you can watch Denzel Washington as he tries to solve a murder before he becomes the prime suspect in 2003's Out of Time. That same day, the service will also offer a couple of corny 70s horror flicks that insect lovers should adore. There's 1974's Phase 4, featuring an army of sentient ants waging war on a desert's human inhabitants. And don't forget 1975's Bug, in which California earthquakes unleash foot-long cockroaches on the peaceful California city of Riverside. On the 9th, watch Casey Affleck and Elizabeth Moss struggle to survive a dying world in the post-apocalyptic thriller Light of My Life. On Christmas Day, Prime Video begins streaming 2018's Night Hunter. The psychological thriller stars Henry Cavill as weathered detective Walter Marshall tracking down a serial killer that targets young women. Ben Kingsley also appears as a former judge turned vigilante who's launching his own investigations, while Alexandria Daddario stars as criminal profiler Rachel Chase. Looking for a little drama? On the first of the month, you can check out 2000's Almost Famous, which follows a teenager who gets tapped to tour with the fictional rock band Stillwater and write about the experience for Rolling Stone magazine. Plus, there's the 1987 John Hughes classic, Some Kind of Wonderful. After that, you can cut loose and show your rebellious dancing side by watching the 1984 hit Foot Loose. Finally, you can watch Leonardo DiCaprio become the legendary Howard Hughes in 2004's The Aviator. Amazon Prime Video is a little light on comedy offerings in December, but its new arrivals include one impressive standout, 1999's Man on the Moon. The biopic about the late Andy Kaufman is named after the R.E.M. single Man on the Moon, which paid tribute to the unorthodox comedian. Jim Carrey plays Kaufman in a performance that saw him staying in character for much of the film's production, both on and off set. Carrey won a Golden Globe for his efforts, and the film is largely regarded as the moment any doubts that Carrey could excel as a serious actor were dispelled. While the actor made his bones playing absolutely ridiculous characters like the lead of The Mask and the Ace Ventura Pet Detective films, Carrey made great strides in the late 90s to broaden his horizons. 
His portrayal of a man who doesn't know he's the subject of a lifelong reality series in 1998's The Truman Show convinced many moviegoers Carey could do more than straight comedy, and The Man on the Moon convinced many of the stragglers. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Looper videos about your favorite movies and TV shows are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.